Do you think that the 90s was a good moment for women in rock? I mean, to have something like Riot Girl emerge and people like Kathleen Hanna, who you write about in the book, and I really, you know, she was an amazing person, great person, is. Um, yeah. yeah, I mean, no, I mean, that was a, that was a huge, that was huge, but, you know, at the same time, um, um, you know, they didn't want to be exploited by the mainstream media, so they had kind of a media blackout. And um, in fact, um, my friend Tamara Davis did a short film, um, I can't remember what it was called, I don't know if you saw it, but it was like she interviewed me and she interviewed Kathleen and a few, a few other women. And I remember Kathleen wearing, um, you know, the ski mask. Right, right, You know, right, the pussy yeah, right, yeah. And, and um, being interviewed with that over her. <laughs> her head, because she was in a media blackout. To maintain. Uh, um, but you kind of wanted that to end that, right? I mean, you put her in the video. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I, um, she um, was Heather. a really good sport and agreed to be in um, our video below Heather, which, um, you know, MTV videos classically always have dancers, and uh, I wanted to have at first the Nick City dancers. They danced with the basketball team and um but it it um you know the vision got a little more focused and then uh, <laughs> uh yeah i thought it'd be great to have kathleen kind of in a way in this way entering into the mainstream or just kind of as like this intervention in our video as i thought about it and um but it was a big deal for her because um pretty much her community was against mtv and mainstream media.